Hey everyone, and welcome to our biggest feature update yet, scheduling pages. In this video, what I'm gonna do is give you a walkthrough on how to set up a team page and how to book meetings with multiple teams. P.S. Editor's Cut. Um, this actually was 16 plus thousand lines of code. So let's give our team some props. This is the second video. So if you want to learn how to set up an individual page, go ahead and check out the previous video. Go to our YouTube channel, check out that walkthrough, and that's going to show you how to set up an individual scheduling page for yourself. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the demo. Part two of the scheduling pages demo. What we're gonna do is show you how team pages works. So if you go to the previous video, you'll see how to set up an individual page. Here, I'm just gonna use this test one that I created in the video before and I'm going to click edit. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to enable team page. So here I'm going to send an invite out to one of my team members, AKA fake email that I made. All right, so let's go ahead and sync that. So I'm going to save changes and you're going to see this meeting card has disappeared essentially. It actually went to your team pages section so team pages that are owned by you and then also when people create a page they're going to be able to share that page with you as well all right so what i'm gonna do is since i'm on the same browser i'm just going to go ahead and i'm going to log out because what i'm going to do here is i'm, I'm going to go to this email so this would be for example a team member they would get an email from sidekick it's going to say, hey, you have an invite to join this team page. They're basically going to join the team page. And here, they basically want to sign up or overlay sync their calendar. So here we're going to go this one. All right, we're going to allow. So now this is working and literally it's that simple. So your team member clicks here, they click join, they sync, and they basically click the scheduling page. So here we can see this one's owned by others. They can copy this link, but what I'm going to do is I'm gonna log out and I'm gonna take us back to the creator, the main account that created that team page. So let's sign in. All right, I'm gonna go back to team pages. I'll go to my team page and I'm going to copy this link. All right, so here we can see that this person, Jim has accepted the team page and he uh, is on this shared team page with me. So these times, that Sidekick is going to produce are gonna work for all these team members. So you can share this team page with basically a client, a customer. You could book these internally. So you can have five to six people that are going to be on this calendar and you don't have to go back and forth. When's the best time that works? You don't have to share all of your calendars. Essentially, all, all these times that are presented are going to work for everybody that's on your team for scheduling. So we'll just go ahead, for example, just book like a 930. We'll just say video call, Google Meet, test, tester at gmail.com. Also too, there's an option where they can invite additional people if they want, but we're just gonna go ahead and book this meeting. All right, so the meeting has been booked for Thursday, August 26th. This is going to be added to everybody's calendar. This is going to be added to everybody's sidekick dashboard and everybody also is going to get a confirmation email that their attendance has been confirmed and they will be uh, signed up for that meeting. So here, let's just go to there. So I think it was August, forget when it was now, um, but it was, so I believe this one. So attendees, yep, so here we go. So this was the one. So the attendees, we could see here. So this meeting was booked, 9.30.
this was added to your sidekick dashboard. And then also this is going to be added to whatever calendar that you have associated with it. So if you have a, you know, your Google calendar, your outlook calendar, sidekick will automatically add that for you. If you guys have any questions, email me at chris at sidekickai.com. I would be more than happy to answer any questions. And we look forward to getting some really good feedback. If you guys have any uh, integration requests, just let us know. And we'll look into adding those as soon as possible.